Hi everyone and welcome back to the 2014-2015 school year. Thanks for joining me for my first vodcast of the year. I've got something very special to share with you and that is the announcement of our 2014-15 Visiting Scholar. In the past we've had Charles Renfro, architect, Neil deGrasse Tyson, television personality, physicist, and director of the Hayden Planetarium, and Jeffrey Tubin, legal analyst and author. And this year's scholar is Jill Abramson, author, journalist, and former executive editor of the New York Times. We're thrilled to have Jill joining our community for the year, where she will do several evening presentations for the entire community, work with our students grades 4 through 12, and critique our student newspaper. Earlier, academic dean Will Hopkins and I sat down with Jill to talk about her time at Friends. We're making some very exciting plans. Here's what she had to say. What excites you most about coming to Friends Seminary and doing this, this residency? Getting to know the students. Uh, I can say that without even having to think about it. Uh, and the fact that you have so many different age groups here at Friends and that the student body is diverse and that the kids are so bright. I just can't wait. They're going to love it, I'm sure. Tell me a little bit about your experience as a Quaker school parent uh, back in our Washington days. Well, I love the values of a Quaker school. Uh, my daughter went only 9 through 12, and I really wish she had got, had the advantage of going really K through 12. And I love the weekly meeting for worship, which gives the students a chance to reflect, to look inward, and also to look outward to the community and to issues of concern that are sometimes discussed. I think it's just such a good opportunity to bring the student body together and that that too rarely happens in most schools. Well in the rush of daily life there are not many schools that say let's pause together, think, process, and plan. So it is a unique opportunity. Really is. Um, what, what topics do you think you might address when you're here? What's, what's on your mind? Well, I mean, in terms of the news, uh, there are so many big stories right now, whether it's the threat of global terrorism or New York City about to change their transgender law. I mean, you name it, I'm interested in talking to the students who might be interested in you name it. And I will love sharing some of the experiences I've had as a journalist, whether I've gone to Afghanistan or I covered Washington DC and our government for more than 20 years. Uh, I'll love sharing my stories and if they're interested in journalism, I'm still passionate about it, trying to you know, encourage them and teach them something about the subject. They will love you, I have a feeling. <laughs> Thanks so much, and we're looking forward to welcoming you to Friends. I'm so honored to be a part of the community here, Bo. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thank you for joining me. I know you're excited about this. And stay tuned for more information about Jill's presentations, the first of which will come to us in late November. But more to come. In the meantime, have a terrific fall.